Giants turning to Tim Lincecum to help them maintain their slim lead in the NL West. The right-hander threw eight innings of one-run ball against the Rockies earlier this month. Well, Lincecum cruising early. Bottom of the second gets Melvin Morris swinging. Then in the third, Miguel Olivo, same result. How about Jolie Chassin? Well, he gets a taste of his own medicine. Speaking of Chassin, matching Lincecum pitch for pitch. Top of the fourth, Aubrey Huff in the box. He goes down swinging. Then later, Pat Burrell, same result. Chassin, no hits through four. We move to the fifth, Jose Guillen leading off. And there goes the no-no. Lines one to center. The Giants' first hit of the night. San Fran, though, would not score in the frame. So Lincecum says, you know what? I'll do it all on my own. Bottom of the fifth, two out. He gets Ian Stewart swinging. Lincecum perfect through five. Bottom of the sixth, Seth Smith leading off. Loops one to left, and that one will just drop inside the line. So there goes the quest for perfection. That's good for a double, putting a runner in scoring position with nobody out. Later in the frame, Smith now on third, two out, and Eric Young finds a hole in right. Smith scores. Rockies strike first, one nothing. Top of the seventh, one on, nobody out. Pat the Bat lives up to his nickname. And the 2-1. High drive. Left field. It is... Out of here! Pat Burrell with home run number 17. And this one was huge. Giants move in front 2-1. Chassin gave up two runs on three hits and three walks over seven. He fanned eight. Bottom of the eighth, Lincecum still dealing, two out, and he gets Miguel Olivo to ground out to third. Lincecum gave up one run and scattered two hits over eight stellar frames, struck out nine, walked none. Bottom of the ninth, Brian Wilson in, two out. Pinch hitter Jason Giambi stands in his way. On the ground, Uribe. Uribe, ball game! And game one in this three-game series goes to the Giants. Wilson gets his 45th save as the Giants top the Rockies 2-1 and hand Colorado its fifth straight loss. San Fran maintained its slim lead in the NL West.